We've seen these violent swings for nine months or ten months this year. The first part of the year was volatile. Then we did nothing. Yeah. Why have we gone haywire in the last month? Well, I, I think investors are grappling with a, this idea of a global deceleration. And what is unique to that is we're seeing it in China. We're seeing it in Europe. We will begin to see it in the U.S. But at the moment, the U.S. trend remains quite strong. So as we look out and we say, where can you make money? The answer is really in the U.S. That is the place where trends are still holding up. The deceleration. You think, you think, you think so? You can still make money in U.S. stocks? Because yes. Lipper data showed that last week, $46 billion was pulled out of U.S. mutual funds and ETFs the most ever. People are selling. Well, and, and if you look at what the expectations are, the market has sold off so much, it is telling you that the economy must be going to recession or crop, corporate profits must be going into recession. And when you look at the expectations of 2019, growth for U.S. equities, 7 to 8% for EPS growth. That is not a recession. That, that, is, that is not mixing and matching with the concerns that we are hearing and with what we are seeing. Are you worried that the market does not seem to be responding positively to positive trade news? I mean, the stuff we just gave you, the breaking news on China, is not the end of the world. I mean, it's fairly good news. And the market's not reacting. Well, right, right now, volatility is high. And with volatility high, the, the moves tend to be quite sharp. And we see it intraday. We, we see big swings. I expect that over time, as we continue to get you know, more positive news from corporations yep. this uh, fourth quarter earnings season coming up, then volatility will come 30 down. 30 seconds left in the show. Where do we make money right now? I would recommend taking down economic exposure portfolios, go with companies in charge of their own destiny, technology or Stable companies, healthcare is a great example.